In this video, DHT11 sensor interfaced with 80 mega 8 microcontroller is programmed to display temperature and humidity on LCD. A circuit diagram of the implemented system is shown here. We have the LCD interfaced with the 80 mega 8 microcontroller where the data lines are connected to the most significant nibble of port D and we have the register select connected to pin PB1 and the enable connected to PB0 and we have a DHT11 sensor where the one wire bus line is connected to pin PB2 of the microcontroller In a previous video, I presented a detailed tutorial on how to program DHT11 sensor using assembly language. To better understand the C code presented here, I highly recommend watching that video. A link is available in the video description. The sketch is written in C, and no libraries are used to program the DHT11 sensor and the LCD. The programming code for the LCD was explained in my previous video. Here I will focus on programming the sensor. Inside the loop function and after a delay of 2 seconds, we send the start signal to the sensor by calling this function. Inside function start signal, we program pin PB2 for output where the DHT data line is connected and then we send the start signal which is 20 milliseconds wide back inside the loop function and after we send the start signal we call this function to receive a response from the sensor inside functional response signal we set pin PB2 for input and then wait for the low pulse once we get it we wait for the high pulse and then we wait for the low pulse again Back inside the loop function and after we receive the response signal from the sensor, we call this function to read the first byte which is the integer part of humidity and then we read the second byte which is the fraction part of humidity, the third byte is the integer part of temperature, the fourth byte would be the fraction part of temperature and finally the fifth byte would be the checksum value. Function read DHT11 is designed to read the incoming byte from the sensor. So we use a for loop that will loop eight times and then we wait for a high pulse. Once we detect the high pulse, we apply a delay of 50 microseconds and then check the value of the uh, pulse. If the value of the pulse is one, then we uh, store a one in a variable data byte, otherwise, we store a zero in variable data byte and then we wait for the DHT11 low pulse and then repeat the process eight times once we have the byte we can then return to the calling function back inside the loop function and after receiving the five bytes we can now display the temperature in Celsius and then the humidity in percentage to conclude, more devices will be interfaced to 80 mega 8 microcontroller and programmed in C without using any libraries. Thank you for watching.